BML just launched Plato Metrics. It's part of Plato's mission to bring more transparency to capital markets. And as we all know, in Europe, capital markets are very fragmented. And this fragmentation brought along competition, which is extremely good for the markets. At the same time, though, it also brought along complexity. And this complexity sometimes makes the markets a little bit tougher to grasp, especially at an intuitive level. And so what we have done is we thought about how can we make sure that these simple questions like what was the liquidity in the market yesterday? Which part of liquidity was accessible to me? What was actually the real picture of a stock at the millisecond level? These questions should have simple answers again rather than complex answers. That is why we at BMLL brought together our granular market data access and our data engineering capability with the insight from the Plato uh, working group who are people who have been in the markets for a long, long time and have really good understanding of what people want to see and what people need to see and launch Plato metrics together. So what does this actually mean to participants in the market today? Uh, we are really adding value in three ways. The first way is thinking about liquidity and think about the buckets of liquidity. When somebody looks at what traded yesterday, due to the complexity of the market, there's a lot of information and there's a lot of noise. And combining that information with our understanding of what is noise and what is really insight, we, together with Plato, devised four liquidity buckets. And that really uh, helps the participants of the markets to understand and grasp intuitively what's going on in the markets. So that is the first kind of added value of Plato metrics. The second is getting an understanding of the best bid and offer at a millisecond level with uh, a real good graphic uh, presentation of what's happening in today and the ability to drill down uh, at the lowest possible granularity. And last but not least, we added some metrics, what we call market quality metrics, which allows uh, participants to get a better understanding of the venues, comparing the venues with each other and comparing stocks on venues on certain standardized metrics, which we hope will become the market standard of looking at market quality going forward.